Before I started my course, uh, I knew that there would be a lot of writing involved. So I started to write a diary in English instead of uh, Polish uh, because that gave me the uh, confidence to put words on the paper. So thing to start with simple sentences and just to write what's happened in the day, it's a really good uh, preparatory thing to do. There are different forms of writing uh, expected and um, fortunately uh, Open University provides very good um, booklet about how they should be done. Uh, not only in theory, what is expected uh, in each section, but also um, there is a, a given example of um, written piece. What is brilliant about it, it's not that this is um, an example uh, written by uh, a tutor or some academic. No, it's, it's actually written by a previous uh, Open University student. It takes me a few hours to write an essay, about 10 to 15 hours. Once I finish uh, the essay, I tend to read it and uh, see whether there is or there are any points, grammatic, uh, grammatical points, that I may have uh, completely missed. Adam, mm -hmm. do you mind coming? My husband is English and is a journalist, which helps uh, a, a little bit when it comes to reading my essay. Um, he helps me go through my essay and tells me if I'm there are any sure grammatical points I have to rewrite. You need a comma after data. Are you sure? Yeah, it's a subordinate clause. Oh. When I started writing essays, I felt that the more you put in, uh, the better. Through uh, the comments that I was getting from, uh, from my tutor, you know, I was learning to start structuring my essays better. And I think uh, the way I did them from the beginning, I answered the question for myself. But later on, I was able to, uh, to learn that it was about you know, um, the other person understanding. It was about the reader. The question was about the reader understanding the meaning of what I'd written and I found that very helpful because then when I was writing I wasn't thinking about myself, I was thinking about the person who was reading and if they would understand what I was explaining. The more I read, the more uh, I am aware of what is expected, how the sentences uh, should be constructed uh, in order to flow and have this uh, academic feeling to it.